Hey, what is up, everybody? Michael Crump back here again, talking about the latest and the greatest in PlayStation homebrew news and much, much more. So I know there has been all kinds of things happening in the PlayStation scene just over the last couple of days, but I wanted to provide this very quick update that I saw on Twitter just a little bit ago, and it was from Hardware.io. And what they said was, can anyone explain what's happening here? And then there was a code snippet right here. And this code looked to be something that was related with a console or a PlayStation, for example. So if we go back to the thread, we can see that not very shortly after, really about two hours ago, they posted, loved the way curious minds from the community stepped in to figure out what's going on. So here is the answer. And it says, Spectre, that he will showcase the evolving attack surface and ushering in of modern mitigations like supervisor mode access prevention, investigate the internal workings of the PS5's hypervisor. So the keyword there is hypervisor. Now, obviously, I've talked about hardware.io before, and really it wasn't that long ago. It was actually right around 11 months ago when I basically was wondering, will the flow reveal a PS5 jailbreak at hardware.io? And in case you didn't know, this is where finally we got to see how we were able or how he was able to originally get debug settings on his PlayStation 5. So in short, if you were going to reveal something, hardware.io would be the place to do it, mainly because you're now at a bigger stage. It is a recorded conference. It is only filled with security experts, so you look great in front of potentially people that you're going to work with. So it is a place that I would probably show the world what I had been working on if I were a security researcher. Now, back over here to the tweet, we can see that there is a date on this, which is the 2nd and the 3rd of June 2023. And so Spectre Dev himself said, maybe, possibly, conceivably, which obviously kind of gave this away as soon as this happened. And yeah, you can see, obviously, people are excited about that. Now, going directly to hardware.io and where his talk shows up, it is right here and it says, talk title, next gen exploitation, exploring the PS5 security landscape. So I'm gonna jump through the abstract real quick. So it says the PlayStation 5 represents a significant leap in technological advancements, particularly in terms of its security measures, which have undergone substantial improvements compared to its predecessors, the PS4. Due to the lack of public documentation around its security hardening techniques, there exists some misunderstanding of the system security infrastructure. This conference talk aims to shed light on the PS5 system architecture, focusing on Sony's efforts to impede reverse engineering and mitigate the impact of kernel memory corruption. This presentation will delve into the intricacies of the PS5 security mechanism analyzing the evolving attack surface and ushering in of modern mitigations such as supervisor mode access prevention, supervisor mode execution protection, kernel control flow integrity, and execute only memory XOM. Furthermore, we'll investigate the internal workings of the PS5's hypervisor and analyze its roles in safeguarding the system against high-privileged attackers. We'll also talk about how some of these mitigations can be worked on and highlight some avenues and ideas for future research. So it really just kind of has the bio in here after that. But if we do go to the schedule right here, if we go to conference day two, we can see that right here at 2 p.m. is going to be when Spectre's talk is going to be shown here. And so if you were following Twitter around that time frame, 
obviously you would see people that's live tweeting. Now, they don't live stream these conferences, but we'll absolutely get a video recording of it. And just like I've done with the flows, talks, etc., I'll obviously analyze those and I'll share that back out to you all. But anyway, I just wanted to give you this breaking kind of news update because I really believe that we are getting very, very closer to the hypervisor and especially with several of the mentions right here of the PS5 hypervisor. So again, if I were a security researcher, this would be the time that I would show it to the world where I've got a big audience and I've got a bigger stage. Anyway, I hope you got something out of this video and I will see you on the next one. Michael, out!